Hello, this is Ethan Minsker from the Antagonist Art Movement. We're here in Red Hook in Brooklyn. It is September 25th, I believe. 26th. Let's go meet a new artist. Right in here. How's it going? My name is Jay Ipsovich. This is my uh, studio down here, Red Hook, Guanas. Mostly a painter. I think that's kind of been most of my focus, but I also do a lot of uh, installation work sculptures. I've always had a tough idea with just hanging paintings on the wall. I felt like there was always, I like to have different things accented as well, so, but it always focused mainly on the paintings. And one of the, one of my signature styles is do, is painting in relief. I paint with uh, dental syringes. These here are plastic. I can cut the applicators off, so it's almost like decorating a cake. Highly illustrative, textural relief work. A lot of it deals with cultural observation. Lately I've been juxtaposing urban American iconography with Southeast Asian temple imagery, whether it be prayer flags or, you know, like we have gas station flags, streamers, or grand openings from stores. It's kind of juxtaposing that with Buddhist prayer flags and stuff. So taking this view of urban, the chaos and noise of urban America and making it more contemplative, sublime, and in, in a way kind of like a Zen-like secular spirituality out of it all. So that's kind of been the focus of the work and it manifests itself in a lot of different ways through these kind of illustrative graphic paintings. They used to be a lot really hard-edged. Here's a good example here. But lately I've been exploring real washed out watercolor, very saturated work that kind of, which is different for me because the paintings uh, develop as the process happens as opposed to it being very strict uh, linear imagery. So. There's a lot of stuff here to see around. This is kind of interesting, actually. I was in Asia last spring, and I had one of my paintings done in silk embroidery. I thought that would be an interesting idea to, instead of having prints of your work, as far as additions, why not have it hand embroidered? And therefore, it would keep the textural element of my work intact. And so that was an interesting project. So there's a lot of projects here in the studio, some successful, some not so much. But, but yeah, this is, uh, this is pretty much where it all happens. Sometimes there's music being made here as well. But yeah, feel free to take a, take a look around and you'll see a lot of different stuff. I don't have an artist website. My name is Ivcevich. There's not a lot of us out there. It's I-V-C-E-V-I-C-H. So if you Google just the letter J period Ivcevich, you'll find a lot of archived reviews, links to galleries with work images that way. Sometime soon maybe I'll get get it together and have an actual website for artwork but uh, at this point I've subsisted without and uh, I think I make so much work it'd be hard to update it all the time but one of these days I'm, I'll get a bit more organized with it. But for now just Google my name and there's there's enough out there you'll find. Fortunately for me the last name is unique enough that there's not a bunch of us out there so you can do that. <laughs>